Hi, my name is Frank Mishagwanu, originally from Zimbabwe, but now relocated to Cape Town. I'm here to tell you about my story. Uh, my story is a bit unique that, in a way, I didn't picture myself in, in, in the media business, for I am an agribusiness graduate, but due to my love of communication, my love of social media, I found um, what I can call my calling. It's not that um, my project has a name. My project, I'll call it Project X, X for Anon. For I believe when I started, I didn't have like a big project or a big task in mind. What I just wanted to do for the love of technology and trying to get Zimbabweans together, I thought that the easiest way to get people together is to use technology. When I came to Cape Town from Jobbeck, I found out that there was a gap in trying to help Zimbabweans understand. And I came when the, in the period where there was the permit issue. Then I tried to find out on Facebook what was going on. Then I got hooked up with guys from Jobbeg who were running Mwasa, a Migrant Workers Association of South Africa. And I brought Mwasa to Cape Town, hooked up with a couple of Cape Town leaders. This my project is Project X, Project Unknown, and I'm doing it from the bottom of my heart. I was approached again by another group called Ziwasu, Zimbabwe Workers Union in South Africa. There was a certain group that was on Facebook again called uh, Zimbabweans in Cape Town. At that moment, most of the guys who were running it I were busy in school and they asked for my help to help run the page. And for the past three months, I believe this is the fastest growing group on social media in terms of Zimbabweans in Cape Town. Because I believe in December, in October, we are around 5,000, but now we are growing leaps and bounds of close to 500 new people a day. That's when again I got hooked up with this new startup company called uh, Mama Money. They had seen my great endeavors in trying to bring together the Zimbabweans, the economy, the Zimbabweans around Cape Town. And I answered to their call and right now here I am still doing my job and I'm still open to help and disseminate information as long as it's clean information politics aside, religion aside, just building one strong big family together. In the next few years, turn it into something more vibrant, even go all out to include, include print media, to include our television. That's the next project we are working on. A few words I would love to say is just follow your dreams, follow your heart. I believe the day uh, you find out what you really love to do, that's the day you stop working. As for now, I don't consider myself working, I consider myself living.